Hello and welcome back. Feels like it's been forever that I've done another video, but I've literally run out of stuff because again, still waiting on things coming. It's not March, therefore everything that I've pre-ordered and everything like that, still waiting for things. So, hi, I'm Darcy Darkness and this is Behind the Mash Reviews and I'm going to be reviewing these two. These are the two clear ways that I have been using for, it's almost about a year actually. I have tried other companies. And I'm not a big fan of my proteins just because they don't always advertise. Well, they don't always, in their ingredients descriptions on their website, sometimes they don't tell you that there's an artificial sweetener or they don't tell you the exact artificial sweetener. Don't come for me or anything like that. I have a condition that I can't actually have that type of sweetener because it doesn't do may not affect everybody else but it affects me and it affects my energy and it affects my actual health so I can't touch it so when I buy samples that's why I do buy samples because I don't want to waste money buying a big container of the stuff it's a massive container my husband actually drinks the my protein peach tea one because he likes it I don't so so to mix these up, you take two scoops. I'm going to get one of my shakers because what I do is I blend it up in my ninja blender because I don't like lumps or clumps. Now I am drinking uh, apple and blackcurrant one at the moment, so it will be a blue aspirin one. So what I do is I'll take two scoops. Of this make a mess as per usual and this one does this kind of reminds me of anyone in the UK who used to drink panda pops when they were kids that bright blue drink that your mum used to buy you and drive you insane or maybe it wasn't your mum it may have been a relative to really drive your parents insane but this takes 500 ml of water which I'm going to take out from the virgin pure right now I have hubby has set it as the um, the measurement for five hundred ml, which is what these take. The my protein one is three hundred and fifty to four hundred ml. But these are the things that I drink. I drink one when I'm training, and I drink one as a snack, as well, because I need two i used to drink about four a day but i had to cut myself down because i was literally replacing my food with liquid because technically that's what these are so i'm just going to quickly pause to use the ninja blender if anybody has the ninja any ninja that blends of any sort you'll know how loud they actually are so i'm just going to pause it so you are not getting sodiers I'm back. So this is what it looks like after it's blended. It looks doesn't look blue, but I can assure you it is. Oops, sorry. I just hit the mount again. Oh my goodness. I can never open these things. That's the only thing. I don't have the best grip. And my hands are tiny, so as you can imagine, it's difficult to grip. So why am I reviewing a bulk product, do you ask? Maybe you're not, maybe you just don't care. But I'm going to tell you anyway. I am reviewing this because I'm trying, I got a voucher card through a few times for my order. There is affiliate codes and stuff, but again, it would come up with my real name and not my name that I chose online to use to represent my channel. So, I have this card that gets you 45% off, which I thought, you know what, I'm going to share it. Why not? So this is what it looks like. I got this free, this shaker with, again, a pro, again an order a few months ago. So I'm um, not a big fan of weights, but hey, uh, it's a really good shaker. And as you can see, it's completely white, well, an off color of white, and it will turn blue. But once you blend it and let it settle for about 10 minutes, it will, it's, it's starting to do it actually at the bottom. If I can actually see, 
teeny tiny bit you can see. So it's a 45% off full price items that I will be putting in the description below for you to use. Uh, Bulk has lots of different products that I use. The clear way is what I use. That is what I use in training. If you're one of those people who can savagely dry scoop things, fair play to you, because I cannot. I would end up choking myself and coughing a lot. I don't drink pre-workout. I These do not have caffeine in them. That's what I will stress to say. I have bought plenty of bulk things that said that they were not caffeinated. And then when I've got them home, like I said in the description, they don't describe everything. So please be careful and read the descriptions and the ingredients carefully. Even though they might not say they've got it, I would read the reviews underneath just in case. Because the pre-workout pump I used to use was a non-caffeinated drink that I drank obviously about 30 minutes before training with my lunch and then they stopped doing it and then they created a new one and the new one has caffeine in it so no I can't have that so I've had to adapt how I take things but you can just put these in a shaker and add the water and shake with the shaker but again I don't like clumpy bits and as what Scott people here in Scotland would say floaters. I don't like things bobbing about my drink. I really don't. It's really... No, I just can't deal with it. Even thinking about it is freaking me out. So I have a 45% voucher. That, um, like I said, I'm going to link it below. And it'll be over on my Instagram as well. Um, Have you tried bulk? Have you tried their clear whey? Why do I not drink actual whey? Like, isolate? Well, I was drinking so many of these, like I would just said before that when it came one day I just had I was having to, I was having to drink a wee bit extra of them because I was having issues with solid food which again happens with the type of condition that I've got and I just got too much of drinking them that it literally sat in my throat it would not go anywhere and the only way it was going out is if it came back up TMI I know I'm sorry disclaimer I did should have said that first but I just couldn't anymore. Well, the years of taking keto shakes and things like that to kind of bulk out things, eh, bulk out my food to stop me eating things because I was thirsty more than hungry, but I still needed to keep my carbs in check and my sugars in check and like fats and things like that. I had to make sure that my protein was up there. So these helped me and these actually have, because these are all in one and not just clear way, the clear way on one these actually have for 50 grams serving 29 grams of protein so having two of them gets me 58 grams of protein which again i for every pound you weigh is a gram of protein so that's a big chunk of protein for me and these drinks i used to drink one in the morning but i can't even get one down in the morning these days so i am trying heaven knows what's wrong with me just now but I am getting there with drinking them and as you can see from here it's turning blue but this will be this is a actual active rest day which means I still do I still move my body in some sort of way whether I'm doing housework and chores or cleaning or well cooking or anything like that I'm still on my feet for some of the time anyway so I'm burning energy moving my body and stretching of course Monday, my training week starts on a Wednesday. I don't know why, I just like it starting on a Wednesday, even though technically I'm still doing five days in a row. But it just gets me every weekend I can usually have off, or I can, like this week, I had Friday, Saturday and Sunday because I was going to a gig on Friday for the first time in five years. And the first time I've been out, out in about almost, well, it's about three years since I've been out, out, so, <laughs> Yes. The anxiety was you this week, this week, but yes, I drink two of these a day, well, between two and three of these a day, uh, when I'm training as well, I have, uh, mm, I have one of these as well, which is a mineral public electrolyte, it tastes like old school lemonade, and I have either, I tried a new company called Nutribita 
to get some of my supplements because some of my supplements from my vitamins haven't been in stock and I've seen moaned about that constantly that a few things have been out of stock. So I've had to get a few other things like, like vitamin D and vitamin K. Haha, -ha, dick. <laughs> we joke about that in this house all the time. But I got these. Um, it's a three pack of the effervescent vitamin C tablets. And these are raspberry. And now when I add them with a the lemonade, they taste like raspberry lemonade. So that's really good. My whole family take them. But these are, I get these from Lidl. These are like, I think, one forty nine or one eighty nine. And this is these are really, really good. And my son has them as well because they don't taste like an artificial orange. And these don't taste artificial, by the way. The clear ways do not. Don't taste artificial in the slightest. And I had a few chemically tasting clear ways in my time. But they are not. So one of these and one of them. And what I do is I have vitamin D drops that I got from Nutrilita. And I just, it's one drop. So it's basically a year supply I got from my family as a drop, wee drop bottle. So basically vitamin D is very, very good for like helping fight bugs and like really good for your immune system so i do tend to take that as well so again i have done a video about my supplements i might have to actually do another because i actually have changed a couple of things due to again the changing of the season basically you change the season you change your body has to adapt for different things like in the winter to spring and from spring to summer exact etc and the things that I've got to take and adapt for different seasons. So I may or may not, if you want to see my updated, my updated vitamins and supplements that I'm taking, please tell me below. I'm not affiliated with Bulk. I am not affiliated with any of the companies that I use. These are products that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. And I'm just informing you of how good they are and the impact they have on my training and my day-to-day -day life is there anything that you feel that i should try from another company well these are flavored with sucralose as long as it's not as false from k or aspartame or aspartame or whatever you pronounce it i always mispronounce things it's going to happen i'm not going to apologize for it I'd be here all day if I did. Is there another company that you think I should try? Is there something that I have missed? Maybe a company that you know that maybe is in the UK that I've missed? If it's Myoband, I've already tried them. I used to try them. I used to have them actually on my daily routine. But I went on for that in another video about things being out of stock and things like that. And maybe they're not like that now. It's just because of during the apocalypse, lots of stuff was... Uh, sold out and you couldn't get hold of ingredients so please tell me in the comments below if you again know of any other company that might do a clear way that might actually be more suited for me maybe it's high on protein like sugar whatever just please let me know in the comments before if you like my content would you please consider liking this video consider subscribing to my youtube my Instagram and also my Twitch which I'm actually live right now and I've just walked away from my PC to do this because I had forgotten. Nah. But anyway, um, you can come over and ask me anything, um, interact, whatever, tell me what content you want to see and I will see you in the next one and this is Sunday so hopefully I get it out on Sunday. Happy Sunday, happy new week. What three things are you going to accomplish this week? Or three things that you would like to accomplish this week? These are the three things that I am going to be doing this week. I'm going to be highlighting my videos on Twitch so people can see shortened activity on my games and on my lives, on my streams. Uh, two, I'm going to make sure that I film at least two videos with an extra video in case... I run into the kind of no video uploading. I don't want to ever have an empty week basically with no content. And three, I'm going to smash as many of my workouts, five workouts every day this week. And, and when I'm doing my workouts, if I'm just going to do... 
I'm going to do them to the best of my ability as I can. I'm going to push myself as much as I can. And when I can't do it, I'm not going to punish myself or make myself feel like crap. I'm going to keep my macros simple this week because of the fact that I have issue. I've not been eating. As long as my protein is on point and I'm eating at a deficit, then I should be okay. So I will see you in the next one. This is Darcy Darkness and this has been Ang Dimash Reviews. Later.